Trinity B1 ISC1 Four Skills Test CELT Secure English Language Tests B1 English Test ISC1 Skilled Worker Health and Care Worker Scale-Up Worker Student Visas Director um, Review 100 and 130 words for a travel web website about a town you have visited. Mm. You should describe the town. Explain why the town is a good place to visit. You should plan your review before you start writing. Think about that you are going to write and make some notes to help in the book. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, Naveed, you two read it once. Write a, a, write a review 100 to 130 words for a travel website about a town you have visited. You should uh, describe the town and uh, explain why the town is a good place to visit. Uh, you should plan your review before you start writing. Uh, think about what you are going to write and make some notes to help you in the in this box. Good job, Pinal. Read the question, beautiful. Yeah, write a review, write a review uh, 100 to uh, 130 30 words for a travel website about the town you have visited. Uh, you should describe the town and explain why, why the town is a good place to visit. Thank you. Uh, Amina, read the question, please. Hello, ma'am. Yes, yes, yes. Read the question. Easy, easy. Relax. Okay. Then write a review. 130 words for a travel website about a town you have visited. You should describe the town and explain explain why the town is a good place to visit. Yeah. Good. So this okay. is a topic in here. Let's learn how you how we can start it and um, how to continue this. Before you start writing, what is rule number one? Read the question at least five times. How many times at least? Five okay. times. Read the question, and once you've read the question, then make uh, notes like this on your, you know, um, paper that you will get, right? Like this. If there are three points, draw three columns. If you have uh, one or two points, then just, if you have two points, then go for two, two lines. First of all, they are saying that write, don't care what is this. It could be a review. It could be an article. It could be an essay. It could be a letter. It could be an email. You don't care, okay? You okay. do not care. Your purpose is, uh, not even this for a travel website. Don't care. What is this? Your title is about a town you have visited. About a town you have visited. This means it's in the past. Visited. The t action done. Something that you did. Right? Past action. Describe the town. Explain why the town is a good place to visit. So on this uh, page, we, are, we will start writing now. Maybe the first thing that we want to, to write in here is um, the name of the town that you visited recently, okay? For example, I would say um, any town. Let me give it a name. Candy. Rain City. Okay, I'm just calling it Candy Town. Uh, Candy Town. I visit. I have visited recently. I have visited recently. recently okay. For example, the, just just notes, preparing notes, right? Then describe mm -hmm. the town. Think about the town. Restaurants, good restaurants in town, good restaurants, good, park. good parks. More everybody participate in a town. Clean uh, atmosphere or clean environment. You can write that. Good Moscow. Clean environment i don't know you can write atmosphere too it depends if you are good at english you want to write environment or atmosphere what else um uh cheap and clean cheap and clean hotels uh more describe about the town uh, uh nice good roads. good roads i think that's much better good roads okay more mm -hmm. better Weather, weather, tell me, tell me, weather, what type of weather, yeah? Yeah. Tell me, weather, what type? 
Ma'am, uh, one thing I ask you, this is heading? No, this is just notes. I will tell you how to write. First, take notes. First, first plan. This is planning. We are planning, then we will write. First, we are thinking about points. Okay, good restaurants, good parks, clean environment. Good and people then, live there. Okay, friendly people. Friendly people. Uh, somebody was saying of ple pleasant weather. Pleasant weather. Pleasant means good, nice weather, not too cold good, and not too warm. Good, good school in tone. Okay. But every time you use some better words, okay, nice schools, let's say. Nice buildings. Yeah. Okay, more. More, ma'am. Uh, good um, stuff, like security guard. Uh, you can also people. talk about public transport, if the public transport is good or bad. You can talk about that. Uh, nice, uh, good, good public transport. Yeah. Uh, okay. Easily available public transport. Easily available. Public transport. Public transport. Public transport. More, more. Think more. Think more, please. Oh. Everybody, everybody participate. Need you to think. You visit a town. What supermarket? Maybe right. Yeah, Great supermarket. Hmm. Uh, lots of car parking available. Okay, lots of car parking. A lot of car parking. Think more, guys. Museum. Yes. Museum. Playground. Playground. Mu museums. Playground. Mu museums. Liberty. Museums. Playgrounds. What else? Friendly people. Somebody else? Yes. In a town. When you visit a town. Library. People are friendly, okay, library. Normally when we go to a town, we see that roads are cleaner. Uh, environment is clean. I think it's better than the cities. Uh, this, the town looks small. The towns are small, right? Small, Yes, ma but clean, uh, friendly people, nice food, you know, traditional food also, nice supermarkets Pleasant. around, you know. Pleasant weather. Pleasant, nice pleasant weather, nice buildings, uh, more um, restaurants or hotels, maybe if you want to talk about them, cafes, anything like it. Okay or no, not okay? Okay. These points are enough. Okay, next one. Why the town is a good place to visit? Now you tell me why town is a good place to visit. Mm-hmm. You can talk about any special place there that it's a good place to visit because food is cheap and delicious. Cheap food and cheap and delicious food. Cheap and not I would not say cheap. I would say affordable and delicious food. Affordable. Affordable. Affordable and delicious food. Delicious food. Uh, delicious food more. Transport is very cheaper in town. Public transport. Good, good places to take photos. Okay. Good places to take photos more. Mm -hmm. uh, special um, special festival in the town. Okay. Special festival. Festival in the town. <coughs> More. Mm -hmm. Meet new people. Yes. Meeting new people. Okay. Think more, guys. Why do you think it is a good place? If you think, I don't know how many of you have visited north of your country, like I think Penal is from India. And in India, also, there are very good places, either it's in the south or north of India. And yeah. also in Pakistan as well. Very nice places. If you go, if you if I if you tell me natural, that natural beauty natural beauty okay natural beauty mountains mountain you, hills birds and um I don't know anything like it I just think about it like in your mind when you're thinking think about the countryside think about something that you understand mountains is also fine natural beauty is also fine a town is small it can be in you know in the mountains yeah. as well. Is that okay? We have enough points now. Now special it is local dish. Yeah, special local food. That's right. Okay, now listen. I am going to 
uh, copy this information and write this on uh, who is sleepy. No, ma'am, I'm here. Okay. It's just a matter of few days. Your exam is going to be over on 20th. Okay. Just a little bit work. Okay. Um, let's start. Now, Amin, are you active? I'm going to tell you how to start it and how to end it. Okay. Listen carefully. The first point in here is, firstly, firstly, I want to, firstly, I want to tell about, I want to tell about a town. I want to tell about a town. I visited, firstly, I want to tell about, about a town, town I visited recently. Visited? Recently. recently. Okay. Yes, ma'am. That is Candy Town. Candy Town, let's say. Candy Town. Candy Town. For example, if boys that you know the distance, then you can say 535 kilometer away from the city. Okay. 35. 35 kilometer. I don't know. Just saying. Okay. You can also say a uh, candy town uh, in the center of the city. Okay. In the center of the country. I don't know. Any, any extra information if you want to write with it, you can. If you don't know, don't write anything. This is the first line. Firstly, okay. I want to tell you, I want to tell about a town I visited recently that is Candy Town. Okay. Secondly, secondly, I want to describe. Secondly, I, I want, want to, to describe. I want to describe the town. Describe, yeah. describe the town. Secondly, I want to describe the town. Semicolon. You copy yeah. this information and then we put it there. So we say that uh, it has good restaurants, comma, parks, comma, comma clean environment, comma. It has, comma. because it's one thing, good roads, good, good roads, comma, yes, good friendly roads. people, friendly people, comma. Yes, pleasant weather. Uh, Roma. Yes. So anyone who is scared of English, these are little, little words. We are not writing full sentences. We're writing little words you already know. Nice buildings. Nice buildings. Easily yeah. available transport. Easily available. Easily available public transport, comma. A lot of car parking. Mm -hmm. A lot of car parking. We comma. Can, comma. Okay. Museums. Museums. Comma. Playgrounds. Playgrounds. Comma. Okay. Libraries. Library. Libraries. Because we are talking about museums, playgrounds. So you have to write libraries here. I. Libraries. And what happens? Small. Small. Uh, clean. Uh, small and what small clean small and clean area. Let's say it. small and, and clean area. Clean area. Okay. Oh, all right. Full stop. See, fifty-three words already done. Yeah, ma'am. Right now, yeah. not doing anything. No extra words. Just commas. Little little words. Everyone okay. knows little words in English. Am I right or wrong? You might not know full words. Full lines, full sentences, difficult, but everyone knows little words, right or wrong. Nice weather, good roads, friendly people, museums, playground. Yes or no? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, everybody knows this. Now let's uh, have a look at this. We can copy this and try to adjust that in there. Um, for example, uh, where did it go? Yes. So in here, you would say thirdly, 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 what would you say? Yeah. Thirdly, 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 I want, I to, want explain, to explain. I want to explain, explain why the town is a good place to visit. Yeah, why the town is a good place to visit. Why the town is a good place to visit. To visit. Semicolon. Semicolon. Okay. Right in front of you, we put in here uh, affordable yeah. and delicious food, comma. Yeah. 
good places to take photos, special festival in the town, meeting yeah. new people, natural beauty, natural mountains beauty and birds, and bird. natural beauty, um, mountains natural and birds. We just need to add a little more. Okay, meeting new people, uh, natural beauty, natural beauty, beauty, comma, traditional food, traditional food, 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 and uh, uh, let's talk about uh, traditional, traditional dresses, dresses, more, think more. Uh, people, hotels, food, amusement parks, biggest, no, no, not biggest. Walking area for women. Lake, maybe. Yeah. Lake. Uh, clean. Running. Water. Lake. Lake. Think more. Uh, Supermarkets, what stores. Zoo. Ma'am, zoo. Waterfall. Zoo. Waterfall. It's a town. It's yeah. not a city. In towns, they small don't have zoos. Okay, small yeah. zoo. You can say you can say that small, small zoo for children of the town. For yeah. children. For children of the town. Town, and a beautiful mountain view. Beautiful. Mountain, mountain view. full stop. Enough. End. End. Now, let me tell you that in this, we are not writing full, full sentences. We just know, everybody knows little English. And we are combining those little ideas together to form this. Okay? Everybody, one time, read this. First, Amina will read this. Amina, read it. Amina, are you there or not? Amina, you need to open your mic. Read, read it, please, once. Okay. Firstly, I want to tell about the town I visited recently. That is Candy Town. Mm. Secondly, I want to describe the town. It has good restaurants, park, clean environment, good roads, friendly people, pleasant weather, nice building, easily available public transport, uh, and uh, a lot of car parking museum, playgrounds, libraries, small and clean area. Thirdly, I want to explain why the brown is a good place to visit, affordable and delicious food, good uh, good places to take photos, special festival in a town, meeting new people, natural beauty, traditional food, traditional dresses, Clean running uh, water lake, small zoo for children of the town, and beautiful mountain view. Okay, if you feel that the words are less, you can say, firstly, I want to tell you about a town I visited recently. That is Candy Town. I went there with my family last week, right? I went there with my... With my family last week. With my, uh, with my family last week or last month. So if you feel that some words are missing, then you add more words here, right? Like I want to talk about this. Uh, okay, about I went to, town. About town, yeah. yeah. If you feel that some words are I missing. Went, you... I went there with my family last week. Yeah, it's okay. Yes, and last week, right? It was, you can add one more thing with it also if you want to. Just one it more thing. A... If you, it was a long drive you know it was a long drive from my house it was a long drive, from, long drive my house. from my house just in case just in case if even if your mind is dead you know if nothing is coming to mind you can still add more words like this and then okay. continue but the main marks are for these two paragraphs what describe the town and tell why this is a good place to visit yeah. you understand or not main marks are for these two points Yes, I... Any confusion? Naveed? No, ma'am. Naveed, you understand me or not? Naveed, are you sleeping? Hello? I think Naveed is not here. Naveed, are you there? 
Hello. Maybe we we'll go for smoking. No, 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 Navid. Navid. <laughs> no, no, no. Navid. Yes, ma'am. Yes, understand or no understand? Hmm? Ma'am, understand. So this is understand, very understand. easy, guys. Little, little English use. Little, little write and pass. This is not hard. This is very easy. Okay? Okay. Okay, now take one question for homework. And then I will yeah, see you guys tomorrow, please. Because then we will do multi-text reading and writing. And then I think we will cover a lot of the things. Uh, Penal, you understand writing or no understand? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Little, little understand. Little, little? little? No, Penal. Say, <laughs> I understand 10% at least. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> Write a letter to your friend about a new house that you have. Bought. Okay, write a letter to your friend about a new house, about, about a new house that you have, about a new house that you have bought recently. You have bought recently. Point one, describe recently. Point one is describe your house, describe the house. Number two, Tell how the new house is better than the old one. House is better than the old one. Okay? Yes, ma'am. This is homework 100 to 130 words, please. 100 to 130 words. I shall be taking your leave. I'm trying my best to help you guys as much as I can because I want each one of you to pass this test. Okay? Thank you. So thank, thank you so you. much. Thank you. I will see you guys hopefully tomorrow. Goodbye.